Uh, good morning pop pickers, this is me Mix here from MTB 101 bringing you a proper test <coughs> on the Cube Stereo 160 Hybrid Action Team E Enduro Bike been riding this bike now for two months and it is a belter it is a beast of a machine downhill single track whoop. and of course uphill it really does fly mind the bush ah. Bushes like that grab your shoulder and in danger of pulling you off. But yeah, this bike is no slouch. It's got a Bosch Generation 4 motor, a 625 watt hour battery. And uh, it's a real flyer. It's 15 miles an hour restricted, as is the law in the UK. So once you get to that 15 miles an hour, you can feel that restriction because you're pushing against the motor. When you're going downhill, you just don't notice that. That's the weight of the bike, inertia, etc. Simply pulls you through. But when you're on a single track, it is really, really difficult to uh, to push through the. 15 miles an hour and uh, believe me you get a proper workout more so than uh, riding a standard bike past and through 15 miles an hour so <coughs> you definitely do a, oops, get a proper workout when you ride a, an e-bike above 15 miles an hour make no mistake so this bike is fitted out with the Fox factory suspension with a ouch with a grip fit for up front that's a 170 mil travel front fork with a DPX2 up at the rear and that combination of factory suspension is mesmerizing it is awesome it takes away all the chatter on the roots on those little roots it takes away all those big hits and it oh, lands like a dream when you take off from those steps and jumps it's uh, got a fox transfer dropper post so the dropper post and suspension is all Kashima coated and it's all factory specification so uh, it really is the best bang for your buck on an e-bike at this, at this price point I'll show you the bike in a minute <coughs> the, um, the wheels are 27 and a half inch and they're Newman mountain bike, uh, e-bike specific 
wheels made specifically for this enduro bike and um, be assured this is a proper enduro bike so if your thing is enduro you're in for an absolute treat okay gotta slow down a bit here for the doggy walkers if they're there the front triangle is carbon rear triangle is uh, aluminium it's a relatively short chain stay for an e-bike so it's very very playful and very nimble and once you start pedaling it really kicks into life the bike weighs 24 kilograms which is not too bad it's obviously twice the weight of a the standard cube stereo and this is where it comes onto its own, into its own is this is like a 500 yard dash up the hill now I'm going to maintain around about 15 miles an hour see if the camera can see that and whilst I can feel my quads they're not burning like they would be on my standard bike so that's far as I'm concerned <laughs> is a benefit yeah the hill's not finished yet Time's nearly over, I'll show you the bike. So there she is. This is the Cube Stereo Action Team 160 Hybrid. The hybrid just means it's an e-bike. But as you can see, really, really slack head angle. Check the description below for the exact spec. Just remember, I'm not an engineer and I'm not a professional mountain biker. I'm just a bloke who likes riding bikes and it brings proper test reviews to members of the channel. So a Fox factory suspension front and rear, DPX2 shock absorber and a Fox float factory 36 D, um, at the front. Um, brakes and drivetrain taken care of by Shimano. Now Shimano have put XTD or brakes on this machine with 200 mil, 203 mil rotor at the front and the rear and uh, the brakes work absolutely brilliantly no complaints there um, the bike is an absolute blazer in its looks just like me good looking and uh, in its performance which is awesome much better than more capable than me just take note of the um, anodized aluminium dust caps which match the orange accents on the bike up on the handlebars cable clips matching the colour accents on the bike and uh, these stop cable slap they are uh, as you can see they're articulated so they move and they allow the cables to move whilst stopping cable slap <coughs> on the rear wheel We've got the uh, dust cap with accents that match the wheels and of course the Action Team colour scheme on the bike. So 27 half inch wheels, uh, Schwalbe tyres, Magic Mary at the front and Hans Dampf at the rear. 12 speed Shimano drivetrain, again look in the description 
and I'll put the uh, the proper spec down there. I'm not an engineer. I'm not a pro biker. Um, I don't remember the, the full spec and I'm not really interested in it really. I just want to know that the uh, bike rides well and it surely does. So the suspension is absolutely spot on. It's awesome. Uh, in the pedal department, I've chosen, as I usually do, my DMRs. These are the DMR Vault. Oi, oi! Mr. Deeks, I can't say the word DMR without saying oi, oi! anymore. I think I'm going to have to go see the doctor. And uh, this, ladies and gentlemen, is the Cube Stereo 160 Action Team Hybrid E Enduro Bike. Please, if you like the video, give me a thumbs up like. If you want to see some more videos, and I'm going to review the, the standard Cube Action Team very, very shortly. So if you'd like to see that, hit the subscribe button so you don't miss the video. So. I've been Mixer, this has been the Cube Stereo 160 Action Team. You've been fantastic to ride with, and I'll catch you on the next video. Bye for now.